Oil and politics have always been mixed. The reason when you go abroad to find oil and gas resources is of course to earn money. You know, fishermen, they wonder what is going on. Normally it should be good fishing by now, here. But it certainly is not, no. Is that you finished up now for Christmas? No, we're, we're going to go back to sea more than likely when the weather allows us. If we don't catch our quota, because the year's been so bad, the crew won't, they'll have no pay, like, you know. Uh, yeah, we've seen some activity now on the Porcupine Bank the past three or four years, carrying out seismic work. The way things are going, I suppose, you're going to see plenty of rigs off the west coast of Ireland in the future. When the oil is here, uh, prosperity is there, uh, and they can uh, make money I didn't could dream about years ago. We had, uh, luckily enough, very good politicians, uh, something like 40 years ago. So they sat down and made laws that made the income of the oil and gas should go to the Norwegian population, not the multinational companies. Uh, drilling oil on the fishing ground and shooting seismic to scare the fish away is real madness. You should never be alone. The most important type of energy that we really need, it's food. Make big mistakes about natural resources, and that's it. There is no rehearsal and there is no second choice. It's gone. <laughs>